Mexico's Popocatapelt volcano news and eruption activity update. It's had one moderate explosion. According to Volcano Discovery, Mount Popo, Volcano Mexico, activity update, one moderate explosion associated with incandescent fragments. This was yesterday, November 13. Senapred recorded one moderate explosion at 22.03, ejected incandescent fragments towards the east, onto the volcano slopes, and 130 emissions of gas and light ash content, which it dispersed towards the northeast direction. Ash plumes reached 24,200 feet altitude. According to Centro Nacional de Prevención, the volcano agency, November 12th, it's an active volcano. The eruptions were from 1345 and on, every few years. 1345 to 47, 1354, 1448, 1504, 1509, 1512, 1518, 1519 to 23, 1528, and all through. It really didn't stop. Now, 1942 to 43, 1947, 1994, 1996, 2003, from 2004 up to now, it's been ongoing. The typical eruption style, dominantly explosive, construction of lava domes, Plinian eruptions at intervals of several centuries or a few thousands of years, Volcanian and Strombolian activity in intermittent phases. Now it started, uh, uh, of course, it started a couple of days ago. November 11, explosive activity continuing, Volcanic Ash Advisory Washington warned about Volcanic ash plume that rose up to 20,000 feet. One day later, volcanic advisory again ongoing. Information suggests possible VA emission. We'll gather further information, issue full advisory as soon as possible. Well, we've had more. November 13. Volcanic Ash Advisory Center, Washington, issued following report. Area Mexico. Eruption details, possible VA. We received information suggesting a possible VA emission, volcanic em uh, emission. We're gathering further information, issuing full advisory again as soon as possible. And November 13, Ash Advisory. Eruption details possible at 13, uh, 821. We received information suggesting a possible emission, gathering further information, issuing a full advisory as, full as, as soon as possible. Okay, well, it's ongoing and it's erupting. The status is erupting. Four out of five scale. The background is the name is. Uh, whose name in Aztec word meaning smoking mountain. It's 5,426 meters height, southeast of Mexico City, forming North America's second highest volcano. The glacier-clad stratovolcano contains steep walled 250 to 450 meter deep crater. It has a glacier on top of it. The generally symmetrical volcano modified by sharp peaked Ventorillo on the northwest and remnant of an earlier volcano. At least three previous major cones were destroyed by gravitational failure during the Pleistocene, producing massive debris avalanche deposits covering broad areas south of the volcano. The modern volcano was constructed to the south of the late Pleistocene to Holocene El Frial Cone. Three major Plinian eruptions, the most recent which took place around 800 AD, have occurred from Popo since the mid-Holocene, accompanied by pyroclastic flows, voluminous lahars, and swept basins below the volcano. Frequent historical eruptions, first recorded in Aztec codices, have occurred since pre-Columbian time.
If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media, and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece, in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.